Saturdays are for the boys, but this week is for the best announcers because Brandon Kelly, Andrew Yalowitz, your Boaz are back and better than Ezra with your morning announcements. Tickets are now on sale for the Senior Athlete Banquet. Please stop by the athletic offices, cash or check me out at the ESM Varsity Leaders Club to purchase tickets. The banquet will be held at East Wind on June 13th. Are you in grades 8 through 11 interested in running for a student council or student government position for the 2017 to 18 school year? Election packets are available in the library, main office, and attendance. The forms are due May 17th. Any questions, please see Mrs. Ebel. Attention all junior high student council and 7th and 8th grade student government officers. There will be a brief meeting on Thursday, May 18th in room 1508 to discuss Friday's dance. All officers must attend. The last World Languages Honor Society meeting will take place on Tuesday, May 23rd at 2.15 in room 2848. This is our last meeting for the year, so please join us for a celebration. Also, please bring your service log forms if they are completed. And now, over to Lizzie and Summer with your world news. Good morning, ESM. It's Summer. And Lizzie here with your world news. On Sunday, Kim Jong-un oversaw a rocket launch that was warned Washington that the United States mainland is inciting for a range for a strike. North Korea launched a new type of projectile missile which reached, with, which reached an altitude of up to 1,245 miles, seeming to be a new record for North Korea. Emmanuel Macron just became the youngest president of France after sweeping the victory last week at the age of 39. Yesterday <laughs> evening, the Miss Universe organization crowned our new Miss Universe. Congratulations to Cara, Miss District of Columbia, on her title win. In other news, a cyber attack, mainly attacking business networks, continues to cripple computer systems across the world. China and, Jap and Japan have both fallen victim to the global ransomware cyber attack that has created chaos in 150 countries. The Japan Computer Emergency Response Team Coordination Center said 2,000 computers at 600 companies in Japan have been affected. Well, that's all for today, ESM. Be sure to protect your computers, and don't let the Monday blues get you down. Have a great day, ESM. Keep this on the down low, but the fest is happening this year in June. The fest? Yeah, the fest. Film festival. The film festival. Help the 